Thank you for joining us on another video on how to use a typewriter. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you how to use the Silent Super Smith Corona typewriter, the fifth series. This video also applies on Sterling typewriters and Clipper typewriters by Smith Corona with some modifications. As for now, Let's start with the demonstration. The Smith Corona comes in special cases called the holiday case. To open the holiday case, there's two pins on the front. You press on the two buttons of the lock and it will release the lid. Open it. To remove the typewriter from its case, there's a lever on the left side of the carrying case. You push it away and it will release the typewriter from its base. You lift the typewriter from the front first and then pull it towards you because there's two pins on the back and now it's free. To unlock the carriage of a silent super, you simply push the carriage from left to right and it's unlocked. To release the carriage, you have a carriage release lever on both sides, one on the left, one on the right side. You press it and it will release the carriage as you are holding it and it moves the carriage from left to right and right to left. To set up your margins, there's a left side margin setup and the right side margin setup. To set them, you press it down and move it left or right depending on your selection. Same applies to the one on the left side. On the left side of the carriage top, there's a small lever to help you select the number of line spaces you need. One, two or three line spaces. One, two or three. To release the platen for variable line spacing, there's a pin on the left side of the knob. You just pull it out and it will release the platen for variable line spacing. To set it back to normal, you just press the pin on the left side inside the knob and it's back to normal line spacing. Another way to release the platen is using this small lever. You push it down and the platen is released. To return it you simply push it up and the platen is engaged. To insert the paper we use the paper grip release lever on the top right side of the carriage. You ungrip it by pulling it towards you get a paper, insert it inside the under the roller, grip it back and feed the paper using your knobs. Then you need to raise the paper bale, make sure that the paper is under the paper bale and feed it all the way up. To adjust your paper and align it, you ungrip the paper release lever and I align it in the best way and then grip it back and feed the paper down using the knobs and now you can start typing. To straighten the paper from the back there's paper support arm that you can manually release and you've put the paper in this way now it's all clear in front of you. Now you finish typing the line and you want to move to the next line, use the line spacing lever on the left side of the carriage and drag the carriage using the line spacing lever and it will take you to the next line of the paper. And then you can type again. To remove the paper from the typewriter, you release the paper grip release on the right side and simply pull it out and return the paper support arm on the back. Smith Corona typewriter offered a nice option for their typewriters and it is removing the roller from the carriage itself. It works on the silent super and the sterling. To remove the roller from the carriage you lift the paper bale you open the margin cover on the back 
The pin on the left side knob should be pulled out. There's a small lever inside the carriage near the right knob. You push it up and pull the roller out of the carriage to the right side and now it's free. This is a nice way to clean inside your carriage and make sure that there's no sticky paper here and no dust on the sides. To insert the roller back into the carriage you get the left side and put it on the left side of the carriage and push it all the way. Make sure that the paper uh, fingers are above the platen. Same applies to the paper finger on the right side. And you push the roller all the way to the left. Now it's fully inserted and this side you need to push it down and this lever will be back to its original position. Then push the pin on the left side of the knob and the platen should be nicely moving as it was originally. Now you can return the paper bale and close the carriage cover from the back. Just to make sure that the clipper model from the Smith Corona will allow you to remove the platen and from the carriage but you need to remove some screws on the right side. This might be on another video. Kindly note that the original manual is available on our website as a PDF version to be downloaded for free to be used as well when needed. Another nice option that the Smith Corona Silent Super have and the other models is the touch control. To re uh, change your touch control you open the lid and there's a lever here from low to high and it has the numbers 2 to 6 as well. To lower the tension on the keys you put it on the L. If you prefer pressing hard on the keys or striking hard you can move towards the 4, 5 or even the H at the far left side of the options. Smith Corona typewriters have a nice and easy manual reverse ribbon mechanism. You can use the lever on the far left side of the typewriter to manually reverse the ribbon from moving from left side to the right side and from right side to the left simply by moving this lever on the left side. On the right side of the keyboard there's a color selector. You have three options the original color which is the first color on the ribbon which is usually black. Then there has, you have the stencils option when the pay, uh, ribbon holder is not moving when typing and there's the second color on the dual colored ribbons usually here it's red. On the left side of the keyboard there's a backspace key. You press it to move the carriage from left to right and to correct any mistakes you have done on your typing. On the right side of the keyboard there's a key with MR on it. It's margin release. How to use margin release. So when you are typing and you reach the end of your line and you can't type anymore and you still have a couple of letters to type you press the margin release then you can continue typing the letters you need. To bypass the margin on the left side you also can press the margin key, margin release key and just move before the margin set. Smith Corona typewriters have tabulation option. To use the tabulation you press on the tab key on the right side and this moves your carriage. To set up your margins you press this key set. This is the first tab I set. This is the second tab I set. And when I press the tab it will go to the first set tab and now it moved to the second set tab. To clear my tabs you press on the CL key here. You press it and it removes the tabulation and to remove the first one I press on the clear. And to check if all are cleared, you press on the tab and it moved all the way to the left. The next thing to talk about is shifting. There's two shift keys, one on the left, one on the right side. You To use the capitals, you press on the shift key and type and it will type your capital letters. To continuously type using capital letters, use the blank key above the left side shift key 
this key you press it and it will lock your capitals and you can continuously type these letters to free your cap lock you press on the left side shift key and it will release your capitals lock to lock the carriage of a silent super smith corona you hold the carriage from the left side knob there is a lever near the right side knob underneath you push it up and it works as a carriage release lever and you let the carriage move to the left side and automatically it will stop on the left side and you just release it and now it's locked to place back the typewriter in its carrying case make sure that the carriage is locked this is the holiday case To insert the typewriter inside its carrying case, you make sure that these two pins there go into these two holes on the back of the typewriter. That's the first step. Push it towards the end. Then there's a pin on the front goes into the hole under the spacebar and you push it down and it's locked. Now you can close your frame case. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like to know more about typewriters, please check the video we prepared about the top 10 typewriters for authors, writers and novelists.